Hi guys, every time somebody subscribes to my channel I check out their channel to see what videos they make or what videos they watch and one of my recent subscribers had liked a video by Rick Crosslin which is a build video for this FPG9 which stands for Foam Plate Glider 9 inch by Jack Reynolds. So it's Rick Crosslin who did the build and I'll put links to his build videos in my video description and I'll also put a link on how to download the PDF file for this pattern as he calls it here by Jack Reynolds. Now in fact I've printed this off without thinking about it and it's too big for a 9 inch foam plate so I'll have to resize it and print it off again but looking at it it's just about the right size for one of my pizza tray um, or polystyrene pizza trays so I think what I'll do is I'll actually do use this one to mark up the pizza tray and see if we can make one from there and then I'll resize it and make one from the styrofoam plate. So I won't do a build video, I'll just make them and try them out. If you want the build videos you'll have to have a look at Rick Crosslin's videos. So you'll have to have a look at my video description for the links. I followed the instructions and there's my two planes. So now we'll have to go and fly them.
that was a very frustrating session in the park. You may have noticed we had wintry showers. And then when we drove home the sun came out again. So we stopped off at a different park. And that was just too windy. It was too windy anyway when we started. But I'd hoped it might um, calm down a bit. At this moment, if you look at that tree up on the right there, it's relatively calm, but uh, it's gusting on and off. Looks nice blue sky out there at the moment. I don't know if you can look at the bottom of the picture, there's the cloud bank over there, and behind us there's another cloud bank coming over. But I'm going to waste a few minutes throwing the planes in my garden, see if I can get some nice level flights. Because when I tested them before we went out, they were perfect, spot on. Let's have a go.